In the past hour, Onondaga County Executive Ryan McMahon has declared a state of emergency in Onondaga County, also announcing that all schools within the county will close beginning at 4 p.m. Friday. It's important to note, though, there are still no cases of coronavirus in Onondaga County at this time. Now, News Channel 9's Jeff Kulikowski was at the conference. He joins us now live. Jeff, a lot to digest after this press conference this afternoon. So let's begin with those schools and why the county is waiting to close until Friday. Well, Nicole, there's a couple of reasons. First off, what you had mentioned, as the county executive said, there has been no reports of any confirmed cases within a 60-mile radius of here. So that is one of the reasons why they feel they have a little bit of time. Second of all, closing schools impacts a lot of people, from bus drivers to parents to teachers and et cetera, a lot of people. Third of all, districts need to actually figure out all the particulars of what distance learning will be and what it looks like. So here Here's a basic timeline of what the Onondaga County Executive, the mayor, and some school officials laid out for us. Starting today, all non-essential extracurricular activities in any schools in Onondaga County are canceled. Starting Monday through and including Friday, there will be school. School will be open those days, but any parent who wishes to keep their students home, this will be considered a legal excuse, so there will be no penalty if you choose to keep your students home. However, know that school will be open Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Then, at 4 p.m. on Friday, schools close until Tuesday, April 14th. That's when they're planned to reopen as of now. We need to give time to deal with child care issues. We need to make sure that families are working on these child care issues and not asking grandma and grandpa. And there needs to be a plan in place to take care of our community's most vulnerable. Now, the plan, according to the East Syracuse Manoa Superintendent Donna Desiato, speaking on behalf of uh, other school leaders in Onondaga County, is that distance learning will begin on Monday, March the 23rd. That is the first day students would not be in school, so no real gap in, in education right there. Um, this would all change, the county executive says, if they do get a report of a positive test of COVID-19 in Onondaga County. In that case, they would anticipate closing schools at the end of the day on Wednesday. Of course, there are still several details to be worked out and that's what they hope that this next five days hopefully uh, will be able to give all the districts and be able to communicate that to the parents in the proper amount of time. So that's what we have for now Nicole live at the county office building Jeff Kulikowski News Channel 9. Jeff thank you for working to get all that information and we do have the entire press conference from County Executive Ryan McMahon for you on localsyr.com underneath the coronavirus section. Now a